Hello, welcome back to my channel where we explore the world of data visualization. Today we will create a song key in Tableau with a new method. It's completely free, requires no calculation, no template and no extension. So sit back, open Tableau and let's get started. Okay, so I have Tableau open and I will select the sample superstore data source uh, and then select the category of product and the ship mode. And finally, the quantity of product. So we have a really simple uh, table. We will select all the lines, click on view data, and then go to download and save our simple table as a CSV. That's it, your data is already ready. We can use now that CSV file directly in the tool to generate the sync. Let's open a web browser and go to tools.ladatavis.com. I will put the link in the description. We are going to cl click on Sanky. Uh, from the Sankey page on the top left, you can select a file and we are going to put our CSV. And voila, we have our Sankey showing the flow of quantity of product between our categories and the ship mode. I promise you a Sankey in three clicks and here you have it. Now let me show you how you can customize the Sankey directly in the tool before we are going to export it. Once you have imported your CSV, you can configure the view, change the width and the height. At any moment, you can also reset the parameters. You can customize your link. If you have multiple fields here, you can select the fields that we will be used for the size of the links. If you select constant, all the links will have the same size. This allows you, for example, to look at the number of flows that goes from one node to the other. Let's select again field. You can also configure the nodes and change the size. For example, here we will increase the size to 195 to be able to add the title of our nodes. You can also customize the padding, the alignment, in our case, the alignment doesn't do anything because we only have two levels. If you try with the default example when you arrive on the page, you will see that it changed the alignment of the nodes in the view. Finally, you can also select the different sort. Here we want to sort our nodes by quantity descending. So the nodes will be ranked from the one with the highest quantity to the lowest. Let's download the Tableau desktop file. This will download a TWBX and if you open it, you will see that you have your Sankey directly in Tableau with some interactivity and one worksheet. If you find this cool and you think it will help you, please subscribe to the channel. This is your way of helping me in return. Now we have our visualization in Tableau. It's time to add some customization and interactivity before we publish. On the worksheet, you can see that we are using maps layers. So we have links and nodes. So if you are on links, you can change the color of the links. And if you go to the nodes, we can also change it to a dark blue or a light blue, for example. The advantage of using a map layer is that you can use more than two different types of marks in the visualization. And that's really important here because currently we don't have any title in our nodes and we will see how to add a new layer to show our title. Let's add our titles. So we will take the nodes and add them as a new marks layer. Now we can take source ID, put it in label, the index in detail. Let's take the value and put it in label also. And let's not forget to add the type in detail. So currently we cannot see much. We are going to change the marks to text and then click on text and edit our text. First, we want the source ID, so the name of our notes, and we will put it a bit bigger and in bold. And finally, we will put everything in white. So now we have the title of each of our node with the value. We just have an issue with the value because we are using four points to create uh, the nodes rectangle. So we need to change the measure of the value into maximum or minimum, just to have a single value per each node. Let's change the title of our marks to title, just for it to be easier. Now we will go to nodes and change the color just to have something different. I like this dark blue. Then let's go to links. And here what we would like to do is to have a column that will show us the top three links in our Sankey. So we will only have the top three in a color and the rest in a different color. So let's create a calculated field. We will call it top three. And in the calculation, we will say we want the rank of the max of the value. And it's important to say descending because the highest value should be the first ranked. And this needs to be lower or equal to three. Now we can take our top three calculation and put it in colors. So currently it's not working because our rank is not computed correctly. So let's go to top three and change the table calculation. And we will just say that we want to calculate our top with index and parent. And now you should have the top three link 
being in a color and all the other in a different color. So we can close this. And now the only thing that we have to do is simply choose the color that we want. For me, for the link that are in the top three, I want an orange. And for the one that are below, I will choose like uh, the blue that, that I usually use. Something like that. And I think we can also add some border just to see the link a bit more efficiently. And yeah, that's it. We have our song key that is customized and designed. Now you have a really simple song key in Tableau with the colors, with the configuration, ready to be published. But what I want to show you is how you can go from like a two level song key, currently with categories and ship mode, to a multi-level song key. So we will add another level after ship mode to see how the flow of the quantity continues after the ship mode. Finally, you will see that we don't have to customize again our song key in Tableau. We can just update the data source with the new generated data. So if we go back on the tool to generate the song key and we click on the question mark, we have a bit more explanation on how to create a song key with a CSV. And actually as to create a song key, we just need some source and some targets. Currently in our data, if I open the file that you have, the category is the source and the target are the ship mode. So what we need to do is to create a new CSV where this time the ship mode will be the source and target will be something else like the segment, for example. And then we will merge the two CSV, the one where ship mode is the target and the one where ship mode is the source, and that will generate a multi-level sync. So back on Tableau, we have our table with the categories, the ship mode and the quantity, and we will create a new worksheet. And this time we will put the ship mode first, then the segment, and again, the quantity in text. Now let's select all the data, view data, download, and we will name it ship mode segment quantity. Let's save the file and go back to Visual Studio and also open our new CSV ship mode segment quantity. So this time ship mode is the source, segment is the target. Let's create a new file and what we will do is we will copy our first CSV category ship mode inside this new file and then the second ship mode segment in the new file also. So now we have combined the two CSV we generated with Tableau. We need to remove the column title of the second CSV and for the first one we can rename it to source target and that's it. Let's save the file and we will call it multi-level sunkey. So now we can go back in the Sunkey generating tool. Let's select the file and use our multi-level Sunkey. And that's it. We have our multi-level Sunkey going from the categories to the ship mode and the ship mode to the segment. Again, we will increase the size of the nodes to 190, sort the nodes by quantity descending. And now instead of selecting Tableau Desktop, we can use CSV. So we will download just the CSV data of this Sunkey. Now we return in our Sunkey in Tableau double click on the data source and then in the connection we will edit the connection and go in our download folder where we have our sankey.csv that we downloaded. If you go back to the sheet you will have your multi-level sankey. Thank you for watching this video. I have more tutorial on my channel so check them out. I have actually one here to show you how to create a network chart in Tableau. I plan to make much more video about how to do things in Tableau but also in these three and in Svelte so please make sure to subscribe to the channel to not miss any future video. Thank you, my name is Christian, see you next time.